This is Shukra Zohe Kyoku, aka Triple Mint, and welcome to my let's play of I B something something with a really really long name. In the last episode, we have known about the past, the secrets that Rin is hiding, and reconcile with Rin. So, what will we do next? Oh yeah, the last episode, I believe, like Sakaki is um kind of like in the last episode, I believe Sakaki has blackmail us or something of that kind because um this ring, I Tatsuzuki Sakaki, am convinced. I in the past. Assessed to Sorai Kun, making use of Orange Thirteen. I had them grow IB and lead it to me in the future now, which will complete peace, eventually achieving complete harmony in the world. I have the duty to select the future now. Are you sure it is? It's not just like word domination and、uh, brainwashing, sorrow, hatred, loneliness, regret. Even though you said you manage them, isn't it based on your opinion? It's not any kind of criteria or something. It's just on your own opinion. So that's not really subjective, uh, uh, objective at all. It's not really fair at all. It will be the world without any of them. And again, he just say they that AI manage it more. The world where nobody takes the blame. The world where nobody seeks for atonement. The world where I, twenty years ago, will be saved. The world where hasn't even wished for. I wonder who. For those who've read this note, please feel relieved. I will make a firm commitment to a wonderful future. Twenty years from now, which you select. Chapter Seven, Final. I guess we're meeting the final box in this, in this way. Tatsuzuki Sakaki-san, why is our future going to become the world where AI controls all emotions? Controls, huh? Oh wow.、Well. We all have different perceptions. It's both. Oh, that's what I wish for. To realize peace, we needed to input a gigantic amount of emotion data. I actually made that part happen by having you and Orange Thirteen, Kikuchikun meet. But the thing is, you started feeling skeptical about the completion of peace. Then I thought I had to rid you of anxieties. What's the ideal future? Setting I B as a peace. The future should be where we feel comfortable. So we all can express our honest feelings without any hesitation. What you mean is, so we are easily controlled, no? So right, Gun, you're misunderstanding here. I'm not fanatic. I'm not fanatizing about our future twenty years from now, okay? The world twenty years from now is square. There will be no regret, which Kikuchi Gun mentioned. 
That's why Kiku Chikun has been supporting peace. I thought you would understand it too. You're wrong. Rin San is. It's been a half year since you've been gone. I felt it was so long. I mean, in Ren San situation, so her friend is the person who has accidentally got in a car accident. So you don't know where or when it will happen or not to say thing. Maybe you thought I should say that thing, and then tomorrow I'll I wait no, I I should say that thing tomorrow, and then stuff happens and、uh, an accident that you cannot say that thing again. But if we take it normal situation, like if there. Actually, wasn't any accident at all. Then they would just. It's like Rin would say, "Um, I forgot to say something last time, so I want to say it this time." So, it depends on your luck and destiny, fate, perhaps. It's not. Regrets are meant to happen. You will have regrets because we don't know what will happen in the future. Even though we get rid of all social、um, difficulties and barriers, it's not certain that there will be no sorrow, hatred, sadness, and so on. Like for example, in the future, you don't know whether when you will die, I guess, or something of that kind. So this is a very ambitious idea in plan, but it's not very logical in a sense. Actually, the whole whole like perfect world that they are talking about is not actually a perfect in a sense because things happen. This、um, AIs and robots cannot control it. It covers a lot of aspects in life that a mere like it become a better word, a peaceful word, or something like that. That he he was saying earlier is like it's not realistic. It's very idealistic. Perhaps he saw it in the future that he came from, but I mean something is about to happen, you know. But this is it. I've decided to be the same as you. In this memorable place with you. She's now wishing for such a stupid word, which you aim for. Just like your daughter. She's gonna be wishing for the word where. She we can live as human beings. Dang it! Don't you ever mention me for you. Me for you. It's true that she was wishing for the inconvenient word. I knew it, but I believed that she would understand peace over time. But that didn't happen after all. Why? Because she just couldn't give up on the inconvenient word. She quarreled with Kikuchi Gun in such an inconvenient way and got lonely. Ended up being killed. She was my only child. The dead can never be revived. Then what about us, who are living in this world now? What do you think those who want to be forgiven should do now? I will make peace happen. I will deny the future which maybe you wish for. The future where we lose maybe you. Just because she had wished for it. Well, actually, in the future she will be dead. No, no. Um, you're just making it like fancy so that you can do whatever you want. I'm sorry. I spoke in a stern tone. 
I usually don't expose my emotions, though. But you, you need to make our ideal future happen, no matter what. Now you can go ahead and search for the lock any time. Which Kikuchi Gun used to give you permission to access? She'll be busy preparing for the app development contest. So she isn't able to work with you. You know why, huh? You suck. Can't be helped. I'm serious too. I'm looking forward to seeing you at the contest. If you don't show up, everything that Kikuchi Gun did will be for nothing. All right then, good luck. Has it done? Dang it! Yikes! Has it done? Snap! What the heck? I'm 100% controlled here. He never listens to what I want to do. Everything was planned from the beginning. It was planned. There's, there's nothing I can do. How about Rin? Is she gonna be in danger if Ivy doesn't go to Sakakisan? Yeah. But if Ivy actually did go to Sakakisan, we are gonna have the future which you never wish for, right? Yeah. Then Ivy will disappear. What? Hold up. If you do, nope. Rain will be fine. The system itself won't disappear. What will disappear are judgmental standards or experience that Ivy has. I've learned this from you and Rain. Heart. What is a heart? What is individuality? Is ensured the ability of judgment. No. That being said, you have the ability of judgment, which means you do have a heart. That's it. If they disappear, if Sakaki-san gets IB, he'll make. Peace happen, which has nothing to do with Ivy's will. Even if Ivy doesn't wish for that future, all the extra feelings, except for the human's emotion data and smooth response patterns, will be deleted as a bug, I guess. As long as Sakaki-san is alive and. The chief executive of the app development contest. IB will be owned by Sakaki-san, and only the judgment that Sakaki-san needs will be used out. Why? Why is it? Dang it! So you have your own plan, huh? Why? I mean, why are you guys? Able to decide things so easily. Hehehe. <laughs> Ivy knows everything about Kazuto now. I know Kazuto cherishes Ivy. I know you're so worried about Rain. And I know you know a little bit about how Sakaki-san feels. Kazuto, Rain. Sakaki-san, all three of you wish for a better future. Rin and Sakaki-san have determined what the better future should be like. But you're you, you're a little different. You always watch over Ibi and Rin. 
You've been looking for the future where I be, and everybody will feel happy. I be is so glad that I know everything that you, Rin, and I have learned. It is really worth it. That's why I believe it's not the wrong thing for I be to disappear. This is how I be communicates. Which I be is willing to do for Kazuto and Ri. Hey, Kazuto. What kind of future do you want? I. I will. Initialize I be. Scoff. Hope for the time, the day of the contest. I hope for the time we will meet again, Abby. Thank you for being patient, ladies and gentlemen. Now I'll announce the winner of the first app development contest. Oh, new new clothes, or did we see the clothes before in the chapter where uh, um they sent me went on a date? Cause it's so good. He did right. His technology ability is exceptional higher than any other applicant. I got IB's program and data earlier. If he's okay, I'm willing to hire him. I don't know about that. He is not good at talking to people, you know? Yeah, I know. That's even better, though. He's not brave. He has neither strong will. Um, I guess it's that because of that, you're is he's easy to control, huh? No courage to talk directly to people. Nothing. So you mean he's gonna listen to you easily? Yeah, as expected. But that's true, though. He just accepts what comes to him every day, without resisting anything. People like him, who cannot express their own will or ideas unless they have somebody else help. Such people will definitely be promised to have happiness in peace. Mm, okay. You really don't know him, huh? Yeah, we know something. We know something. Now here's the announcement for the winner. From over five thousand applicants, the winner is brilliant Kazuto Sorai, who developed the interpersonal communication support app IB. Is nervous. IB is the app to support people's communication, inferring their psychological state from a variety of data, such as their facial expressions, voices, and temperatures. Amazingly, it can infer them not only from the voice data but also from writing materials, such as chat. The biggest decisive factor of this winning is that AI's observation or judgment skills can easily apply to any field, which will contribute to our future technological development. So now, let's have Kazuto Soraikun, who won this contest, demonstrate the app. Okay, okay. There's the mic. Uh, yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, it's sweating, alright. It's a space and a reason we need to create. I'm gonna go home. What am I doing here? I don't know what I'm doing. Wait a minute, what should I say now? I mean, 
I have no idea what you're doing. Let's get you away. Is it okay? And you seriously, 5,000 people applied to this kind of little I have ever done. Development contest. They were insane. The one hosted by one reflector only had 10 applicants. Dang it, that is just crazy. How many people are there in this revenue? How many people? Yeah, I, I, uh, yeah, you can see that the the river the first part of that um, monologue is me just saying kind of gibberish. Um, <sighs> uh, stage fear again. Uh, I feel like growing up. I feel sick. I'm just gonna run. Hey, Kazuta. What kind of future do you want? Hmm. 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 What is it? Oh, IB is in his fall. Okay. Uh, I am K Kazuta. So uh, I am. I am not good. Good at talking. Talking with people. So I thought it it would be wonderful if if we have something something that can talk for us. That that's the reason the reason why I why I created. I be. I thought it would make our lives so much easier. But now I feel differently. I, I've seen so many kinds of communications in the process of having IB learn, such as the one where we can feel, even without saying the words. The one where we need to say the words. The one where we keep what we want to say in our heart. And the one where we daringly had to say it because we wouldn't make the words. It's a great thing that all communication will become easier and more convenient. But we shouldn't lose real through communication. We shouldn't get rid of all courage where we want to say what we want to express. It doesn't matter if we make mistakes. We do have various types of communication. We do have a heart where we feel someone next to us. That's human. That's a human. What's going on here? So I've decided I will refuse to accept this award. What? What the heck? No way. Is initialized. I 
I will carve out a new future. This time, I will make Ivy that which never forget will never forget consideration towards others. On my own, I will make this happen. That's a standing ovation. People can change. Kazutokun, when I first met him, wouldn't say such things. Not a good talker. Shy. But good at trash talk. If he didn't meet someone, he wouldn't have changed. And he would definitely become happy in the future. Where everything is controlled by AI. I'm starting over here. Towards the future Kazuto Kun selected. I will never give up on the future that Mihuyu wished for. This is my true feeling. This is what I wanted to tell her. Goodbye, Sakakisa. It might be a little too late, but I will change. Oh, is that me for you? She's really pretty. Me for you. Ooh, holding hands, running together. Uh, if I don't know this is a mystery game, I thought they are they are eloping or something. <laughs> Rinsa. Let's go. Has it good? Yeah, uh -huh. uh, great shaping sense from these two, you know. I mean, uh, it's shippable, it's very cute. The interaction is kind of very cute. Um, an outgoing, charming, bright girl, and a kind of shy, quiet kid. It's the perfect pair because they feel each other uh, weaknesses. So that's real nice. And this is the created scene. Enter bridge call LTD. What is it? Auto saving a few years later. It's about time, huh? I'm super nervous. Are you serious? How many times do you think we tested? I know they were all perfect, but what if it failed today? Nah. That's you, Ren, alright? Hold up! You're talking bad about me again? You just cannot feel people's heart, can you, Kazuto? Oh, jeez. Stop it. I actually have no idea who is talking right now, so... I'm telling you, we cannot fail here. Install completed. Emotional discrimination AI will reset. Database connection completed. Discrimination process will start. Voice recognition completed. Startup consequence completed. Oh, 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 hello there. Mm, that's fancy. He looks kind of different. His hair all like smush up, like all up. It's like, it's almost like a hedgehog. Like, um, in his previous year, all they do of his size hair, a, a, a crunch up, makes him like he has a 
cat ear, and now it, everything is like go up, make it like more. Mature is not the word, but it's more like、uh, not as gentle as before. Ah,、uh, kind of like a zakaza. I don't know. This this fashion sense is funny. But even if we fail, hmm. Oh, hello, dear Rinsan. Looking good, looking good. I still like her、um, reverse hair better, like the longer hair. Better. This one makes her much、um, older, even the、uh, dress. I mean, it looks good, but I like her、uh, reverse lady. We can just start over again, right? You remember, we learn about the three of us. Yep. This is the interpersonal communication support app. The name of the app is. I've already named you, baby. Wait, wait, what, 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 what is this? Um, um, what is this? <laughs> he, he, he actually calls him my baby. Okay, okay, that's really interesting. Is he、uh, more outgoing to the sense that he, he,、uh, he talks like this? Okay. Then please input the name here. The name is. Tana. I be, the future destined by unsociable me. Nice. Finn is the final. Is the end. Um. Okay, just waiting. So, what will we have after this end? Thank you for playing up to this point. If you can complete all the chapters with one hundred percent achievement rate, you will see the special chapter. Please continue to enjoy all app. I be the future destined by unsociable me. Nice. Okay, this should be the end of the story here for I be the future destined by unsociable me. There's a lot of more content that we can explore for this game, but I think it's a good end for this、uh, series for now. Maybe in the future I will. Um, collect all the achievement for each chapter, and maybe we can see the extra chapter to see what it's about. So this game is kind of interesting. It's a process of growth of a boy named Hasito. So he's antisocial, scared of people, not wanting to talk to people, so on and so forth. At first. He has a logic reason for it too,、uh, because of being mocked or being laughed at or something like that during his presentation time. So he's not very confident about confident about himself. So that leads to him being、uh, kind of more antisocial after the incident when he was younger. Then、uh, this IB robot thing happened. It was supposed to be a normal robot, but then、uh, it changed somehow. They mentioned that in the game that this robot is sent from the twenty year or,、uh, after to the past in order to、uh, keep their、uh, future, I believe. It's a bit confusing. <laughs> I don't understand it completely in a sense. Like the robot is IB is sent from the twenty years in the future, back in the past, to ensure that、um, Hazito will win the app development contest. And the main achievement, main goal is to make sure that Sakaki-san will be the owner of that IB app. 
and that leads to the creation of heat. We don't know the future. They, they mentioned a lot about the um, beneficial of getting of such future and so on and so forth, but we actually don't know what it would be. So uh, the thing I was wondering about is about the abusing storyline. Like whether if um, IB is actually sent from the future because we don't know, we don't see the future that they mentioned. Just uh, I don't see in with our own eyes. It's just sayings and stuff. And since they said that it comes from the future, twenty years it was a uh, Sakaki song. Uh, Rin san was a time traveler or something of that kind, or did they transfer their uh, mind back to the past, or am I missing something here? In Hokoro, the game is um, the, the story is interesting, mm, but uh, the way it is um, represent is not very. On the point, yes, it's not very deep. It's not, not hitting all heart and soul in a sense. Like they have these um, topics and these stories related to topics, but um, it's not as much as I feel feel for it, feel for it at all. And yeah. I mean, the, the story that I most remember about this is the, the first chapter. Maybe it's the first impression. And we saw that uh, someone that was uh, uh, about to have a murder. And that's really shocking, that first chapter. Then we have the cute chapter with the, uh, the couples. The couples that um, kind of have the bittersweet ending to it. Bittersweet but happy ending to it. Yeah. Uh, but for the others, chapters with um, uh, information about it, um, with that same theme, it's not as much as I. It doesn't go into your heart as much as I have liked. It feels a bit shallow. Like, um, there's not enough uh, information, not enough to make you feel for that character. For example, we have that um, boss and, uh, and subordinate stuff. Like, you know, they're a little bit about themselves, but um, in the end, their end is. Uh, it's, there's a lot of implication of what happens. You don't. I guess it. I guess it's like, um, what's the meaning? What the what's the meaning of it all? Is it like the uh, ones in not having any regret? Oh, speaking of regret, I have noticed a lot of tone regarding his regret during the story at this point. So, um, I guess the most thing I remember about the story is that. I don't want to regret not doing so or something of that kind. Or maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. But anyway, in general, the story is really light. But um, not all stories in the game have, have made very deep impression on the players, I believe. Like the, the first, maybe it's first impression or something, but the first chapter and the second chapter is very memorable for me. And maybe it's just uh, my shipping brain of finding the protagonist has though with uh, Rin is very cute and IB is very cute too. Maybe. But anyway, thank you all for watching and I'll see you maybe in the next section of this game. Or another new game. Bye bye!